Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. It's Chelsea here from Cats and Cash. How's it going? Doing great, you guys. Last night I had dinner with a very close girlfriend. Um, miss seeing her. We get, try to get together every couple months or so. Um, so we decided to get dressed up, have a girls night. It was so much fun. I needed that so bad. I loved seeing her. I loved catching up talking about her kids and I was able to tell her about my budgeting and it was just a great time. So I am refreshed today. I definitely needed to get out of the house. So looking forward to the budget with me. Riley is up in Adam, of course. She was out there just babbling away. If she pops in, we'll catch her on the cat cam. And yeah, let's get into this. Um, first, I'm going to start off with filling out the top. So it's April. This is the last cash stuffing of April. We had five cash stuffings this month. That was amazing. The Sinking fun stuffing date will be um, Friday, which is the 29th. Sorry, my cat. I <laughs> she says a lot. Riley. Okay, so this week we're stuffing $592. There was a lot that went into figuring out how much I'm going to stuff with, so I'll break it down for you. $300 is the base. That's what I start off of start off with and then I grow from there. $85 is one of the 200 envelopes that we're stuffing this week. I usually try to pick the highest one. So $85 is one of those. $7 is the 26 envelope. $20 is the additional money I'm funneling into my nails slash wax envelope. $180 is the amount that my sister gave me to put in her envelopes, and that brought us to $592. So, let's get into this. I'm going to put my envelopes in the order of my sheet. Okay, so, gas has money in it, and gas has 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60. So $65 in there. Okay. We add $15 a week. So now it'll have a total of 80. And that's a 10 and a 5. Next is nails. Nails has 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62. Okay, so 62 in nails slash wax. <laughs> we add 50. And so it'll have a total of $112, so that's a $50 bill. Okay, Eat Out. Eat Out has $15 in it. And we add 15. So we'll have a total of 30, that's a 10 and a five. Last envelope is grocery. Let's fix this envelope here. Okay, so grocery has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. $8 and we're adding 50 so that's a total of 58 and it's a $50 bill perfect 
So I'll move these to the side, grab a purple marker, and move on to, oops, sorry, move on to the savings challenges. So we have the 100 envelope savings challenge, and we have the 26 envelope savings challenge. So the first two envelopes, um, or the two envelopes that we're going to do for the 100 envelope challenge is 25 and 85, as you know, because of up here. And also, you know, we are stuffing $7 for the 26 envelope savings challenge from up here too. So these all start off with zero. And we're doing 25, 85, and seven. So we'll write these again. So 25 will be a 20 and a five. 85, that's going to be a 50, a 20, a 10, and a five. And then seven will be five and two ones. And both of these kits are available at my Etsy shop. To, um, I have bunch made. These, the 100 envelope comes in pre-numbered glitter paper. And the 26 envelope, I have like this pink and floral design. And then I have like a blue and gold one available right now. They're both, I have tons made of both of them. So if you buy today, they ship today. Check them out if you're interested. That's Etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash cats and cash. Okay. So then we're going to move into our sinking funds binder. Grab the pink marker. And if you're new here, I'm going to count all the money in my envelopes first, and then we'll figure out how much will go into them after. So let's open this up. I need to get a new binder because mine is breaking. And she's thick. <laughs> Five cash stuffings is no joke. Okay, so first envelope is appliances and appliances has 100 200 250 270 290 310 330 340 okay candles candles has 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72. Car maintenance. This envelope has 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. Carport has 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. Casino. This envelope has 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83. Clothes. Clothes has five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, next sheet. Cricket has ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. And something new for Friday, I my uh, money tray came in the mail. 
So you'll see me now have a money tray to organize my money on the side. So it should be ex really nice. And I'm excited it came in and it came in just in time for the cash on stuffing, which like I said, the binder is super thick. So that should help tremendously to have a money tray to keep track of all those bills that I'm going to be pulling out of here. Decor has 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. Gifts. Gifts has 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Household has nothing. Laundry. This envelope has 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Mario. Mario has 1,000, 2,000, 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150. So $2,150. Marissa. She has 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200. Personal has nothing. Riley. She popped in for a second and then ran off. I don't know. Riley has 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75. Riley's rich. <laughs> Riley. Okay, Sabrina, she has 100, 200, 250, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500. Snowball. This envelope has 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 111 dollars in my snowball. Travel. This envelope has 100, 200, 250, 300, 350, 400, 25. 425. And the last envelope is yarn. And yarn has 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Perfect. So now that we have all of our beginning balances or the leftover balances, we can go ahead and figure out how much is going to go into each. So I have a few envelopes that get stuff with a certain dollar amount every week, no matter what, for various reasons. So I'm going to mark those with a star. Appliances, because my focus is to get a new dishwasher. I also have a set amount for carport because that's just a yearly fee. I divided it by um, 50 to figure out how much goes in there. We have a set amount for laundry because it doesn't need that much. And um, 
let's see, Mario, Marissa, those are stuff by my sister, so they have set amounts. Riley gets a set amount. Sabrina, stuff on my sister, so that's a set amount. And travel, because my focus is to fund my Vegas trip right now. So I'm funneling a lot of money into travel and have been. Um, I'm excited to be able to funnel as much money into my travel fund as I am. However, I um, can't wait until I come back so I don't have to funnel as much money into here. And it can be dispersed more evenly, but... It is what it is. I love my Vegas trip, so I wouldn't trade it for the world. So the amounts that go into these envelopes are appliances gets 20, cardboard gets two, laundry also gets two, Mario is getting 60, Marissa gets 20, Riley gets 15, <laughs> Sabrina will get 100, and travel gets 50. Riley. Oh, there you are. Hi. Okay. So then, to figure out how much goes into the rest of them, we're going to take how much we're stuffing, which is 592, subtract the amounts that we do know, and then we'll divide it out by the number of envelopes. Hello? Can I help you with something? That's what I thought. Okay. Anyways, so we'll take the amount that we're stuffing, which is 592, subtract the amounts that we do know, and then we're gonna go, we're going to get a dump a number. Then we're gonna take that number and divide it by how many envelopes are left over, which is eleven, and we'll disperse evenly the amounts into the rest of the envelope. So 592 minus 15, 50, 15, 50, 25, 85, 7, 20, 2, 2, 60, 2, 20, 15, 150. So we have $76 left over and I, like I said there's 11 envelopes that are left that need to be um, designated some money for but I'm going to divide by 12 because I want my snowball to have more than double because the main goal of my budgeting journey is to pay off my debt so I'm trying to funnel as much money into my snowball as I can so we're going to divide this by 12 and that gives us 6 and 33 but we're not dealing with change so we're gonna put six in all of these, and then whatever's left over after that will go into my snowball. Let me put my marker away for some reason. I think I'm distracted. Hey, what are you doing? What is that that you find? What are you doing? What is that? A cracker? I, I don't know where you got that from. Anyways, sorry. Uh, I, mm. You guys don't know how, you probably can imagine how many toys she has and she uh, found a cracker, I guess. <laughs> oh man, my life. I don't know. Entertaining, I guess. Can you stop playing with that, please? Okay. So you enjoy that while I fill in my sixes, I guess. So six. Okay, six, 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 six. All right, now I need to subtract this again. 15, 50, 15, 50, 
two, 12. Twenty-four, two sixty, twenty-six, fifteen, hundred, fifty-six. So that leaves sixteen dollars to go into the snowball. I love it. All right. So next, we'll figure out how much is in each envelope, or how much will be in each envelope. Oh, you got it. Hey, Riley, I don't know why you're so entertained by this. Uh, cheese it, I think it is. I. <laughs> Anyways, okay, so appliances will have 360. So that'll be a 20. Candles will have 78. A five and a one. Uh, car maintenance will have 40. Five and a one. Carport, 36. Two. Casino, 89. And I think I'm going to stop stuffing this at 100. Maybe 150, but we'll see. Clothes, 16. One and a five. Cricket will have 29. Decor, 48. Gifts, 28. Household, 6. Laundry will have 17. Mario will have $2,210. So, and she gave me 20, so that's three 20s. Marissa, 220. That's 120. Personal will have six. Riley will have 90. Sabrina, 600. She gave me 20s. Snowball will have 127. And 16 is a 10 and a 5 and a 1. Travel, 475. That's a $50 bill. Last envelope is yarn, $30. And that's a 10 and a 5. So then we'll add up all of our columns and we'll be all set. Make sure everything jives. I'll speed this up so you don't have to watch me endlessly add these up. So we'll transfer these to page two. So this is page one, seven twenty three, two ninety three, one thousand sixteen, three three, three nine eight. Okay. So we'll move these down. That's 4, 12, 5, 17, and 17. So 200, 240, 50, um, 85, and 17. So the bill count will have 5, 17, 55 bills, 
for a total of 50, 85, 17, 592. Yay, we did it. Perfect. So this should be a great cash stuffing. It's going to make it super thick yet again because we're stuffing with thighs and ones. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm not complaining. My cash on stuffing video is my most favorite video, as you know. And so as thick as it is already and as thick as it's going to get, the cash on stuffing is going to be so much fun. Plus, I have a money tray. Stick around for it. I want to give a quick update on the blanket. Um, I was looking at the cash stuffing video from Friday. That's cash stuffing 4.4. And there is 18 likes on it. So if you haven't liked that video, go ahead and like that video because as you know, I am doing additional rows as long as you do your part. So I'm doing one additional row per 10 likes on that video and you're at 18. So I need two more people to go ahead and like that video. Go ahead and find it. It's cash stuffing 4.4 and get it above 20. Of course, if you wanna keep going and get it to 30, by all means do it, but you're so close. I don't want you to miss out on a row because you're only two away. Also, the subscriber count. Thank you so much to everyone who has subscribed this week. We are up to six or seven new subscribers. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead and press the su subscribe button, okay? Because it's the same deal. Every 10 subscribers I get this week, Friday to Friday, will earn an additional row in this blanket. This blanket that I'm making is going to be a giveaway blanket, okay? So every 10 subscribers, so I had seven or eight this week i need two more at least of course keep going you know i want everyone to subscribe i love talking to you guys i do plan on always giving away blankets i love that i can merge my two hobbies together but you need to do your part right and you need to be subscribed to win the blanket anyway so go ahead and do it um i have a crazy cat i would like to think i'm a little bit entertaining for you guys so go ahead Subscribe, like this video, but most importantly, go like Cash Stuffing 4.4. Get those to count towards the blanket, okay? I have to go into work, you guys, so I'm going to log off here. I hope you guys have a great hump day, and I'll talk to you on Friday for the Cash Stuffing, the last one of April, the fifth one of April. So talk to you then. Bye!